I'm Dr. Jana Kurt, a research scientist here at the Weatherhall Institute for Molecular Medicine. I'm working in the lab of Professor Roger Patient and we are trying to find a cure for heart failure. So the human heart after heart attack is basically once damaged, not able to repair itself. Once the tissue has been replaced with scar tissue at the level of where the damage occurred, this tissue is not functioning mean properly anymore it's not you know working as it should be and this will always be the case so there's not much regeneration happening and therefore the patient will have that problem for the rest of their life to live with heart failure is a very dramatic diagnosis for a patient because basically they're pumping organ their essential organ that you know carries blood around their body for 24 7 is not working anymore so every normal task that involves a lot of physical activity is very difficult to do for them you know they are challenged by easy things like running up the stairs uh, strolling along with their kids uh, lifting things I mean it's very difficult to keep up your normal activity level once you have you know the diagnosis here the fish lay their eggs in and we then are able to look at the separate fish embryos when they're developing separate fish hearts are quite different from human hearts because after injury of the heart the human heart is never able to regenerate and the patient will always struggle with uh, having a less good heart. Well, we want to understand how specifically some heart cells of the fish are able to regenerate the entire heart and how that differs to the human heart. So we are trying to look at very similar cells and how they are different from each other and which genes are involved in that process. So we want to understand how the zebra fish is able to regenerate the heart and then use that knowledge to find treatments for the patients. Ultimately, through our research, we are trying to find a cure for heart failure. 